Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm back at school, if you can't tell by all of this. But yeah, I will actually be doing a little back to school sort of haul um, from YesStyle. I have a ton of stuff to show you guys. I don't know if you, this is all the stuff I basically have to show you. Plus I have a few more things on my desk over here. So it, it's a lot. It's about $300 worth of YesStyle stuff. But yeah, I'm really excited to show you and I hope that some of these items, maybe you'll like them and you'll also want to get them because I think these, some of the things I got are very good for school. Um, whether it's just if you want comfy clothes, very casual, cute clothes, or party going out outfits, anything like that. But yeah, um, let's just get started. So I'm going to be starting off with some of the more comfy, sort of staying at home, staying in my dorm room kind of outfits. Um, the first one I have here is this sort of, um, I don't know what you would call it, very neutral color though, monochrome, just this sort of. Um, I actually really like it. I really like the material. I don't think it's cotton, but it's really soft and it's really comfy. Um, and now just like the overall fit, nothing is like going in or anything. But yeah, I'm wearing some boxers right now, but <laughs> overall, this is probably one of my favorite, like very plain, basic tank tops I bought from Yo Style ever. So definitely recommend. So this is the next one. Um, I like this one a little less than the previous one, just because like I don't like the cut up. It like gets too close to the armpits, and I think it kind of looks weird. Um, I don't know, it like accentuates some of the fat here almost, I feel like it's like too wide. And then also it's like pretty see-through. I don't know if like the camera shows it, but like, like my bra has a little bit of like bow detailing and everything. So I don't know, not the best for that, but if you just want a basic like white tank top, not a bad choice, but I think there's better options out there. This is the last sort of plain tank top I have. Compared to the previous white one, I do like this one better. I think the fit is just a little bit better, but I will also say it is very see-through as you can see. Um, I just do wish it was more opaque, sort of like the beige one that I had before, but other than that, it's pretty good. Um, yeah. So I feel like, you know, a lot of my classrooms are really cold. I feel like maybe some of y'all's will be. So I got this cute little sweatshirt. Um, this is the length of it. So a little bit oversized, I'd say. Um, I. I don't know, I'm not a big fan of gray to be honest, but I do kind of like this like black detailing and stuff. Um, and it's very comfy I will say, but you know, do what you will with that information. It's not my favorite sweatshirt I have, I do have a lot of them, so I'm um, very picky about that. But other than that, it's very nice and thin, so definitely good for, you know, closer to summer kind of weather I'd say. Okay, I'm super happy to show this one to you. This has been like my go-to sweatshirt actually for the past couple of weeks of school. So it looks like. Um, I really love it. It like has a really nice oversized vibe without being like too oversized and you know like like this looseness of it I really like but like you know the sleeves still fit and everything and it's like not too long or anything you know and it's very comfy it is very comfy I do really like it um, and it's very like minimal like design you can see so like very good basic I'd say it has pockets and they're pretty big too so I definitely recommend this one if you guys do want a nice very basic sweatshirt to get um, you know, I usually just pair it with some sort of like tank top or some shorts, so, yeah. So, if you guys have watched most of my previous videos, like yes, style hauls and everything, you've probably seen this kind of top before. I have two of them already. I have a like sage green one and I also have a pink one, but I like this top so much. I bought another one, this time in black. Um, I think like the amount I have will tell you how much I love this top, so. And then along with that, I also have these YesStyle pants. Um, these are actually from a very long time ago, but I just wanted to show them again because I do really love these sweatpants. They're some of my favorites. I don't really know exactly how to show it, but um, there is a pocket in the back and everything, and uh, it's like cinched in waist. But the best part is at the very bottom. I don't want to like show my feet or anything, but like, like here, oh, they're perfect. It has like a little drawstring, so you can adjust how wide this part is. But you can also cinch it in so it if it's like too long because the pants are definitely too long for me i cinch it in and then it sort of like crops it in a way so that's what i really like about these and overall they're very comfy and i don't know they kind of make you look like you have pretty wide hips too <laughs> so i said looking for t-shirts i highly recommend getting some cute t-shirts from your style um some of them aren't like that good quality but like they have really cute designs i would say like this one i don't know if you can tell it's a little bit sheer and everything but overall the fit is good uh, I don't really like the color either, but anyway. Uh, but if you guys do want really good, like, better quality, very comfortable, like, cotton t-shirts, I definitely recommend sort of online shopping at Uniqlo, unless you have a Uniqlo near you, which is not me. So, yeah, I have a lot of those. I highly recommend those. That's, like, my entire t-shirt collection. But, you know, if you want some cheaper options, though, 
um, and some maybe cuter, more basic designs, then yes, that was definitely a good spot to get started on. Okay, so now going into more casual, but like not just comfy, um, I have this sort of crop top. I actually really like it. I wore this outfit to a performance actually, where I did a dance for Hype Boy by New Jeans. Um, very comfy, fits very well. Um, I like how cropped it is. Yeah, the color's really nice too. I like matching it with a sort of white skirt or something. This is my white skirt. Um, it has a little slit here, I don't know if you can see. Um, but yeah, I bought that one from Tiger Mist. It is not from Yes Style, but also very good. Because it has this, it like kind of goes in, so it makes your waist look smaller. But yeah, overall, I do really like this though. And the skirt. Definitely recommend the skirt. Alright, next up I have this tank top. As you know, I really am obsessed with buying little camisoles from Yes Style. This is just another one to add to the collection. Um, I really like it. It has a lace detail and a bow. Um, and it has like, I don't know if you guys can see it that well, but there is like a detailing on it. Um, it's very pretty. It's got like four little dots every so often. Uh, and it is nicely cropped and everything. So I usually wear these with sweatpants, but you know, you can style it however you want. Um, I do wish it was more like cinched in kind of thing because it kind of flares out on all sides. But other than that, I do really like it. Also, I do think it's a little bit high cut here, but overall, I think it's still great. All right, next up we have this green sort of t-shirt crop top vibe. I'm going to be honest, this is definitely not one of my favorite purchases. Um, like I feel like this, it like sort of cinches in, so it feels a little tight on my um, upper arm, which I don't really like. Um, I also wish that it was more cropped or something. Like, I don't know, something about this length, this doesn't look that great to me. So if I like cropped it a bit, you know, that could be a vibe, right? Um, but yeah, also, I don't know. I just don't dig it that much, but overall, yeah. All right, so next we have this sort of halter tank top. Um, I'm not wearing a bra underneath right now, but um, <laughs> yeah, this is what it looks like. I think it's actually very nice. I personally don't like halter tank tops that much, but I think this one's alright. You do have to tie it yourself in the back. Um, I just sort of tied it randomly. I don't know how to make it look pretty. Um, but yeah, I think it looks really nice. It's very nicely cropped. And, you know, just this. These two together, I think looks really good. So, you know, if you want just like a party outfit, definitely recommend this. Oh yeah, that's it. I am sort of transitioning into the more going out party outfits kind of vibes. Yeah. Alright, next. As you can tell, very going out. Um, I am currently covering up my, um, boobies because the nipples are showing um but from what i can show you is that there's this little thing i kind of like this i do really like how this goes across but this is like more personal but i don't really like off the shoulder things that'd be nice to try but eh, i don't really like it because it makes my shoulders look really big but yeah other than that i think if you have like smaller shoulders and everything and you like wearing off the shoulder i think this is really cute you should definitely get it um as you can see it's very sheer here it is also kind of sheer in like this part which is why I'm like not showing you guys. <laughs> so yeah, but overall, I think it's really cute. I don't know if I would personally wear this out. I probably have to wear like pasties or something at least. Um, yeah. All right, next outfit. Um, this, you know, very basic TikTok that just says cowgirl on it. Um, I am once again not wearing a bra, but you know, don't mind me. Um, yeah, I actually really like this. Um, I just do wish it was a little bit more like low cut. I think it's too high cut for me because personally, I don't really like very like high neck sort of things. But overall, it's very nice, very comfy, and everything. Um, and I sort of matched it with this like cargo skirt. It's literally like this short, so it is pretty short. Um, definitely recommend wearing safety shorts underneath. Um, it does have like pockets, like real pockets, so that's pretty nice. There are small, I must say. Um, and it has like a zipper and everything, right? And then I think that's all the pockets, but yeah, it also has like these little belt loops too if you do want to. But also itself is pretty cinchy in, so yeah. But I just, I don't know, not my favorite skirt personally because I kind of wish it was a little bit like tighter around my waist, but it's all right. It works. All right, next up, I've switched to this black skirt, this skirt. <laughs> it's actually one of my favorite purchases I've ever had from YesStyle. Um, link will obviously be down below, but it is, I like wear it almost every day kind of thing. It's really nice. Also, I wore this to a Keshi concert, okay? Like, it also has this little pocket. I like have my phone in the concert, like whenever I didn't want to hold it. It was really nice, so I didn't have to carry a purse or anything. Um, and it's like a pretty big pocket too. And it also like hugs the waist pretty well. Um, I really like that about it. And the other thing has built in safety shirts. Um, and it's also a really good length. I like how short it is. So yeah, if you want a short skirt, it's the best one you'll find. And then also we have this white, it's a little bit sheer, but white crop top, sort of like all the other crop tops. 
I don't like it as much though because I just don't like wearing white, especially when it's so sheer. I don't know, it just doesn't make me look good, but you know, very nice overall. So if you do like white crop tops that are a little sheer, maybe it's your kind of thing. All right, I'm actually really excited for this one. This is actually a Jenny Blackpink dupe. So she wore something like this and so I bought it. Yeah, um, the only thing is that I don't really like the color of it. I feel like they missed the color in terms of duping it. Um, this is definitely a little bit more like yellow green than it is green because I think Jenny's was more green. This looks a little bit just like dry dead grass in a way to me. Um, so I don't really like the color of it, but I do really like the fit, the vibes, everything else about it except for the color. So. Alright guys, something very embarrassing actually happened while I was putting this on. I've worn this before once, but this time when I was putting it on, I was a little bit um, careless and um, so it kind of broke. But I will tell you that it is fixable, I'm just too lazy to fix it right now. Uh, it's just like the little circles sort of came apart and then so it like came out and I'm trying to put it back in. But I was too lazy, so I'll do that like after this video. <laughs> um, but this is what it looks like and if it was normal, it would be sort of like this, more like. Yeah, but it is, you know, strapless and everything. And you do have a little bit risky as you can see um, but yeah I think it's very cute I would definitely wear this out I think it's cute um, yeah I don't really know what else to say besides that I guess just don't break it like me okay so next I just sort of put on a random tank top and my shorts um, but I wanted to show you guys this shrug um, the shrug is from my style um, I've actually been wearing this a lot lately it's really nice it's very like uh, loose but it's also very comfy it's like this sort of knit but it doesn't itch or anything um and it, you can like literally add it to any sort of like tank top any kind of outfit and it'll look good so i don't know definitely highly recommend this drug yeah all right next it's a very <laughs> revealing top you could definitely wear like a tank top inside but i just kind of want to showcase um the detailing here these two little things um i think it's really cute if you're going out maybe if it's a slightly colder day um the only thing i don't like about it is like the feeling of it on my skin like i don't know it's like sort of i would describe it as like polyester almost and i don't know it, you can definitely like feel it and then it has like these little like ridges on it and you can definitely like feel it on your skin so i don't know i guess if you do wear this it would be best for comfort to wear something on the inside but i don't know because mainly the arms where i'm feeling it and i don't i don't usually wear sleeves with this this is very tightly long sleeve um but yeah otherwise i think it's really cute I don't know if y'all are into this sort of booby reveal thing, definitely look into it. Alright, next up, again, I'm not wearing a bra, please don't judge me. Um, <laughs> this is the fit. Um, I definitely think you could like either wear this without um, a tank top or with a tank top. The thing is like, I feel like the color of it, it's like almost orange yellowy, which is not something I'm a big fan of. I wish it was like a little bit more just off-white rather than like orange. Um, but other than that, I really like it. Um, yeah. I feel like you can use it to layer um, a lot of things while still being very cute. Yeah. That was this dress. Um, I do think this dress is a little, it's built a little weird. Um, in terms of length, it goes down to about there. Um, I don't know. I just feel like the way the straps are put in, I don't know if you guys can see that. It just sort of slims out. I feel like it's like very low quality. <laughs> and I don't know. I don't like the positioning of it. I. Like, like, you could almost do it without the straps, and then it could just be like a strapless strap kind of vibe. Like, I don't know. Not exactly my vibe, but I do really like the knit details of it. Um, but yeah, other than that, I like it, but eh, eh. <laughs> Alright, next I have this really cute set. Um, I don't know, it gives me like tennis golf vibes. Got like this little crop top polo. Um, you can button it up if you want. It has this cute like, I don't know, dog on it. Um, it's not, it's like pretty opaque, I would say. Um, the only issue I have, oh, well, it's built in, right? Now it's like slit. So the only problem I have is that I can't zip it up. <laughs> and like, I would say I am like relatively skinny-ish. I'm not like the most skinny, but like, damn, this, this like won't go up at all. Um, and I don't even know what size I got. Like, mm, but yeah, I would definitely recommend like slicing up maybe if you do get this. Um, cause yeah. But other than that, I think it's very cute. Um, I would definitely like just replace this with the other white skirt I have kind of thing. I feel like you could wear this with anything. So yeah, you could even wear this with a black skirt if you wanted, so. Yeah. Alright, so another set. Um, I, to be honest, have seen this set like a lot on the internet, on TikTok and everything. Um, it's about time I got it. I am kind of in love with this set. Um, it's like pretty nice and opaque. I really like how the sleeves sort of like flare out. 
at the ends. It's very comfortable, um, shoulder-wise and everything fits me very well, very comfortable. The skirt itself um, is a little sheer, I must say, so um, yeah, just that. And then the strings here, so it starts from the back down here, and then I just sort of tied it around. Um, trying to adjust it, but it's a little hard. <laughs> but yeah, I just sort of made like an X shape because I think that's what the picture made. Um, I really like it. I think it sort of just makes your waist pop out, gives it a little bit of spice, a little bit of oomph to it. But yeah, I really like it. Um, definitely great for going out, I would say. Like, yeah. All right. Lastly, um, in terms of like clothes, I have this one more set. But to be honest, I don't really want to try it on because just like the material of it is really kind of disgusting to me. And it, I like, I can already tell it's going to be itchy kind of thing. Um, but basically it is a camisole or a halter because you do have to tie it. Um, and then it comes with its like own little shrug that I personally think looks really weird just from not looking at it. Like what kind of shape is this? Like, I don't know. It looks funny to me, but um, I'm personally just not going to try it on um, in case it hurts my skin. Um, but I will show the picture if you guys are interested in it. I will just say that the material isn't the best. So, you know, beware. So now I just wanted to talk a little bit more about the, all the accessories that I got from this haul. Um, since I think school does involve a lot of, sort of extra things. So one of the things I bought were these socks. So I actually have been wearing very, like, I wear short slot short socks most of the time, so I wanted to try getting long socks, and they have these really cute, very basic um, long socks. These are really cute little ruffles at the top. Um, they fit really nice, they're really soft, so um, I think these look great if you just pair them with sneakers, you know, in the outfit, so that's why I got these. Um, I would also suggest just getting like very basic colors, maybe another white or black one too. Another thing I got was this messenger bag, so um, this is what it looks like. Um, this is a fake pocket. I really don't like it because <laughs> Sometimes I was like so debated by it the first time I was like trying to find a place to put some things and then it was a fake pocket I was like what um, but the other pockets are real so I have this pocket here um, You can put like a phone in there this one the zippy can also be like a phone and then you have the inside It's actually very spacious. I would say uh, it definitely can fit like a small laptop um, But it for sure can fit like an iPad and stuff like that um, and they have a lot of different colors, but I personally like this color a lot, so it would just looks something like like that. And then obviously you can adjust the length of it and everything with this. Or, I don't know where it is here. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to start moving around in my room because I already have something set up and I don't want to bring it over there. Um, but I wanted to talk a little bit more uh, of like other accessories I got. So some other things I were investing in were actually like hair accessories. So one of the things I got were actually a bunch of scrunchies. So these are like silk scrunchies. Um, I don't know how to do this. So there's this black one, a brown one, um, this light pink one, blue one, white one, and then like another brown one, but like a lighter shade. Um, comes in at one set, very cheap. So I really like these because I personally do like scrunchies, um, especially silk ones. Like they won't hurt my hair or anything, which is the main reason. Um, I also got um, this big claw clip for when my hair grows out because my hair is very thick. My hair is short right now though because I did get um, a haircut over the summer. And then you can like see me, huh? And then there's this tiny hair clip, which is more for my hair now. Um, also got different colors because I do like colored clock clips. Um, one thing I didn't really want to show you guys though was um, this. So this is a hair volumizer. Um, it's actually very nice because so I have curtain bangs and I have to curl these every day. But sometimes they're very flat. So what you can do is you like you take the front um, pieces of your hair like from both sides and you like just push, put, put that right there. And then you just like let it sit there for a while. And like the point is that like once you take it out, like it's supposed to be pushed more up like that. But obviously I didn't leave it in a lot just now, so yeah. So that's most of the hair stuff. Um, and then I wanted to talk, oh, okay, I have one more hair thing. This is more for going out. Um, like you might have like a lot of theme parties. Um, so I have this like hair accessory kit where you can put like a bunch of jewels in your hair, which I think is very cute. Um, so definitely check that out if you want. Um, it is on your style. Um, yeah, but in terms of other accessories, um, I did invest in more jewelry. I already have a lot of jewelry, but um, I got this sort of layered one. It has like a paper clip and then like a heart locket type thing. Um, very chunky. I don't know if I'm going to wear it often, to be honest. I also got this other one. Very interesting necklace. I really like the design, though. It's very unique to me, so I got that. Um, and then I also got... Um, I haven't tried this on yet, but I got a waist belt. 
So you just tie this around your waist. Um, it's good for if you're wearing very low cut and then like a crop top kind of thing. Haven't tried it on yet, but um, I think it looks really cute. <laughs> um, yeah, and then also I did buy some more makeup things. Uh, makeup products so some of those i got this ego style thing recently um i'll probably show it someday in a makeup video um really cute um especially very natural because sometimes like i use like a very dark shade and it looks kind of bad it just looks like i have like dark circles or something and then i also got this brown um like eyeliner and it's very like fine tip if you can see um so i really like it because the brown just makes it look more natural and also because my hair is like kind of dyed brown too it looks better um but even if you have black hair i highly recommend getting like a brown eyeliner and then another thing I got was um, adhesive, like double-sided tape. This is good, especially for going out. Like if you have like a strap or something, you can like tape um, the inside to your skin. So like, you know, it won't fall off kind of deal. I was also going to try using it to sort of um, hem something without hemming it, but using tape. Um, and then also um, I got a new BB cream. This is actually one of my favorite BB creams um, that I've tried so far. Um, I believe it's from Misha. Um, it's so good. It covers up so much coverage. It covers up a lot of things. Um, just works great. Um, and then another thing I got were these um, cute little gems and stuff. So yeah, like circular ones and then teardrops. So I've actually seen some people using these at school, like during um, like performances or parties and stuff. So I want to get some myself. Definitely good for going out to parties, or especially themed ones. Yeah. And then um, lastly, um, in terms of makeup, I did get some eyelashes. As you can see, I already kind of used some of them, so you can just ignore that. But um, these are actually really nice. Um, they aren't like reusable at all, so you do have to buy a lot of them, and I probably wouldn't use them that often. Because um, I personally don't use eyelashes that often, but if you do use eyelashes often, I highly recommend O lashes. So this is one I have from Go. As you can see, it's a definitely more low key one. This one is called Cloud Nine. Um, they also have more like outgoing designs if you're into that um, so definitely check that out um, i also will have you know discounts codes for dough and of course yes style all in my bio with the link of everything i you've seen in this video also in the why did i call it a bio the description so yeah and then lastly before i end this video i do want to kind of go over um some skincare stuff i actually got because i think you know being a student and everything so stressful skincare is really important if you want to take care of your skin um so yeah one of the first things i'll show you um is this anti-dust cleansing foam so as you can just see it is a good cleansing foam yeah, just use it you know in the shower or something um this one actually i actually haven't used yet but i've heard some good things about it it's a peeling gel sort of like an exfoliant um yeah definitely scented though so if you're into like not scented things don't recommend it then <laughs> um then there's this sunscreen to be honest it has sort of a bad smell but i think it works pretty well um there's no like white cast or anything so sunscreen is very important definitely get a sunscreen you don't have to get this one but always wear sunscreen every day um, and then also I got this sort of like mask. Um, I also uh, I also have acne patches, so um, highly recommend getting like face masks and acne patches. They help a lot during school. And then another thing is I bought this Tsubaki um, hair milk is what it's called from YesStyle. Um, it's very good. Tsubaki is a very like well-known sort of hair product thing, um, but it sort of helps with like heat damage and it smells really good. Um, so I always put it on like before I curl my hair or curl my bangs and stuff like that. And it just makes your hair smell good throughout the day, which is really nice. And then something else I want to show you guys that's not from your style. Um, well, two things actually is I have this like eye stick. So um, it looks like this and you just put it under your eyes every morning and it just sort of helps with like puffiness underneath the eyes. Another thing is this. This is a Japanese perfume, stick perfume. So you, it looks like this. I wish you guys could smell it. It smells so good. You can just like put it like here or like sometimes I put it like in places like that. It smells great. You can get them at any kind of like Japanese store, like I don't know, you can find them in like a lot of like Chinatown areas I'd say. Um, and then last but not least, before I end this video, um, I want to show you guys um, some really cool things I actually got. So I started using serums, this is from, I don't know how to pronounce it, like Inuik. Um, this is the one I use the most, this one helps with like acne and stuff, but it comes with these other two. I don't really know what they do because I don't use them yet, but you know. They'll be in the description, it'll probably say what it is when you click on the link. And then this. This is made by Zhou Jielun, if you guys know him. J Cho, who is a Chinese, Taiwanese like pop singer. Um, but he came out with this little kit. I don't know if you guys can see. It's very, very, so cute. Like it comes with like its own stickers and everything, and it's so nice. Um, but yeah, it is from Haru Haru Wonder, um, but partnered with J Cho. Um, I can't, I'm just going to show you guys what's in it. So you have a black bamboo mist. Black Rice Serum, um, this is a Black Rice hy Hyaluronic Cream, and then a Black Rice Hyal whatever something toner, and then a Black Rice Facial Oil. So it's a nice little kit, nice little box you get, so I highly recommend if you want to like 
bring stuff on the go. It's a nice, like, good kit to have, like, everything you kind of need in skincare to sort of bring around. Or otherwise, just get it, use the product, and then you can reuse the container for anything. Yeah. All right, so that's pretty much all I have for this video. I know it was a pretty long one because um, I did have a lot of stuff to show you guys. But I'm really happy I got to show you guys because it's been a while. Um, and yeah, I'm not going to make more promises. Like, oh my god, I'm going to film more videos for you guys this semester because I know I'm not because I'm actually really busy this semester. Um, but yeah, I do hope that I will probably, hopefully, maybe, I don't know, see you guys maybe soon. <laughs> but yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, and yeah, I will see you guys sometime. Bye!